heard of Muhammad Qasim and his dreams. Yes, I heard of him and I heard of his dreams. And he's not the Mahdi, he's just another guy. Maybe he's a dream from Allah, maybe not Allah. And have you seen him? Let's be real. When you look at the guy, when you look at him, do you think, yeah, that's Mahdi material? This My brother Remy Khalil, subhanAllah, the questions you had have been already answered. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wasallam already answered your question. Rasulullah said that the Mahdi is one of us, the people of the household. Allah is rectifying him in a single night. Now let's go look at the opinions and the comments of the scholars. What did Ibn Majid say about this hadith? He said, rectifying him in a single night means he will repent sincerely and suddenly and become a righteous person. So the Mahdi is just a layman, he's just a regular person. Or he will get the required leadership quality suddenly and become eligible to rule people. SubhanAllah. So this is why it's very important. We have to look at the hadiths. This individual, Wallah, is truly the Mahdi. Because when you look at him, the eyes could be deceiving. But there's a reason why Rasulullah told us this. And there's a reason why uh, the, the, the people that gave their whole life to Islam. We have to go look at their opinions. Akhi, you're doing exactly what Dalud. Well, what well, Bini Sayyid did to Dalud. Let's go look at the Quran. SubhanAllah, this, this is why our religion is a very beautiful religion. This is why our religion is, MashaAllah, there's lessons you can learn from the Quran, from the Hadith. But look what Allah told us about what Bini Israel said about their king, Dalud. Their prophet said to them, Indeed, Allah has appointed Dalud as a king over you. They said, How can he be a king over us? When we are fitter than him for kingdom and he has not been given enough wealth. He said, verily Allah has chosen him above you and he has and has increased him abundantly in knowledge and stature. And Allah grants his kingdom to, to whom he wills. And Allah is all sufficient for his creatures needs and all knower. Allahu Akbar. When you look at this individual Muhammad Qasim, clearly you're gonna, your eyes will deceive you. But Wallahi, when you listen to what he says, when you understand the, 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 um, the message is pushing, he is pushing to eradicate shirk in all of his forms. He is pushing the same messages that Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa This individual truly is the Mahdi. So my people, please look. Don't see with your eyes. The eyes can deceive you. Look with your heart. And my brother... Do more research and understand. And don't say things without having or looking in the hadiths. Bring your evidence on why he's not the Mahdi. Don't say, oh, look at him. He cannot be the Mahdi. SubhanAllah. We have to learn the lessons that Allah taught us in the Quran. So learn the lessons and, 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 and don't judge people. And don't see with your eyes. See with your heart. And inshallah, time will tell if this individual, Muhammad Qasim, is truly Imam Mahdi or if he's not. Assalamu alaikum.